Hi, this is Mark Rugan, Manager of Training and Education for Nash and Americas. Thanks for joining us for this uh, show. What I'd like to do is just take you through a short tour of some of the main features of this machine. To start with, let's take a look at the Easy Operator Interface. This thing is so easy to use. It is great because it's very, very visual. It's intuitive and it's based on the Windows product, which means we can expand this and add more features to it in the future. It's a one-touch screen. Just touch any of these buttons to do things like lift the, the uh, rollers up, change the temperatures, turn on the fans. Everything that you need is right there in front of you. And it's mounted on a great little device here called the Swivel Pendant Control. This is actually two laminators in one. You can run hot items through the front here, or you can run cold laminating through the back without waiting. In order to accomplish that, though, we need to have these controllers on both sides. So what we've done is we put it on this swivel pendant control that swings all the way around to the back. So when you're working back here on the back side, you still have the controls right in front of you. And I want to talk about something I mentioned a little earlier. I said this was like two laminators in one. What we mean by that is there are four rollers in this laminator. This giant one you see right here in the front, that's the hot roller, okay? So you're gonna run hot applications through this direction right here. If you go around the back, there are some smaller rollers that are actually used for cold application. That covering on there is a super thermal silicone roller. Now, what does that mean? It means that the super thermal control, the heat that's used in this particular roller, will heat up faster than most other laminators. And it will distribute evenly across the entire piece, meaning you're gonna get consistent results through this particular laminator when you're doing hot applications. In fact, it's even going to recover heat faster. You guys that are doing this, you know that when you run hot applications through, that roller cools down a little bit. But because of the specialized material we're using on this roller, the recovery is 50% or more faster than any other laminator in the market. And that's important when you're in a high production environment. The way we heat this roller up is using what we call infrared quartz heaters. This actually allows the roller to heat up more consistently and faster. So again, that's a production problem that we've solved in the brand new 65 Pro MD. So as you can see, these silver idler bars here are actually chill idlers. Nice cold air goes through there so that as the application is coming out, it is cooled to room temperature, assuring that it's completely flat as it comes out of the machine. In addition to that advanced chill idler back there, our entire laminator is controlled through a pneumatic system. Now, when we use our control panel up here, that allows us to lift and lower those rollers consistently every time. We can use that pneumatic system to make sure that we're repeating the kind of pressure that we need whenever we need it. That's very important to mass production when you're using this particular laminator as well. Now, in addition to the pneumatic operation of the machine, you may not have noticed, but there's a lot of shafts up here. There's actually eight different shaft positions, and they're all very important. There are two combi shafts, four supply shafts, and two take-up reels. And why that's important is that allows you to do any application you want in this particular machine, hot or cold. In fact, I want to show you the supply shaft up here and, and how it solved one of the major problems we have. You know, if when you lift laminates or adhesives and try to put those on a shaft and then lift a shaft on a machine, that's pretty heavy. So what we've done to solve that problem is we've made a shaft that's got a cantilever operation. Here's how easy it is. Just pull this off and out, slide your material right on top, and you'll notice there's these auto grip supply shaft uh, auto grip bands here. What that does is that keeps the material in place and allows you to make micro adjustments to make sure that those uh, the materials line up just perfectly. Once you've got it on there, rotate it back and you're ready to go. That's ease of operation and it takes care of some of those major problems that you may be running into in loading your materials. A couple of other things that are very important in our machines and this is really nice. Look at this table up front here. We call this an easy end feed table. We can lift that right up and get easy access to our rollers here. In addition, if you're operating the machine and something happens, heaven forbid, 
you can just kick that table like that and the machine will come to a stop. You want to know the difference between our machine and the competitor machines? Sit on the table. And of course it has the safety eyes, the safety devices, extremely safe operation for this machine. In fact, it is rated by CE and ETL for safety. One last thing that I want to talk about that's kind of cool, and that is on the back of the machine. There's actually a trough on the back of the machine that allows you to put in small amounts of material. Maybe you don't have a full roll that you want to run through. Maybe it's just a 10, 15, 20, 30 feet of material. That's going to go through the machine and it sits safely in that trough, keeping it clean and keeping it straight as it goes through the machine. But here's the nice part. That particular trough can actually come off the back of the machine and move to the front so that you can use it on either side. I think you'd agree, once you see this machine, as you have today, and once you see the company and the people behind the machine, this is really the ultimate machine. There is nothing like this on the face of the earth. No doubt competition will try to copy it and never will be able to do so. Why? Because of the quality of the way the machine is built and the quality of people building it. This is the 65 Pro MD. I'm Mark Rugen. Thanks for watching.